Alright guys, video 3 here of um, Nod32, removal and detection. I uh, found over 100 pieces of uh, malware, those were uh, pretty much binaries, so over 100 binaries found by Nod. When I say binaries, I mean physical files. If I uh, open up Internet Explorer, Set our home page and our browser. Uh, let's go ahead and disable any add-ons. Go ahead and reset my home page. All right, let's go ahead and do some searching. AVG uh, free download. Uh, we're going to go to download.com slash AVG. able to load that website okay. And if we go to abg.com, we actually go to the real abg website. We're looking for like five samples here, so so far we're two for two. We go to free.abg.com. Looks good. That's number three. And if we go to File Hippo, the download site that I use, loads up File Hippo just fine. And our last test, let's look up some things like Facebook. Ah, if I could just spell Facebook. Loads up uh, the real Facebook. If I look up MySpace. up my space just fine. So I was expecting um, Nod to kind of fail at some of the adware, some of the pop-ups, things like that, but the <coughs> version 4 of Nod, which is only beta 1, has done exceptionally well at cleaning off this PC, allowing this PC to pretty much run normal. Uh, if we take a look at the task manager, Most of the processes you see here, well, pretty much every process looks pretty normal. Um, we don't see any random character type processes uh, which constitute a piece of malware. 
Everything looks kind of like you would see on a fresh PC. Um, so not, I was I was hoping to use Nod uh, in my Adaware test, and I guess I will still use Nod for that. But I was hoping Nod wouldn't detect some Adaware, but apparently it's detected everything and it's removed it, and it's giving me back my old insecure Internet Explorer 6 perfectly runs fine so nod 32 version 4.0 looks like it's on the right track big time so anyway that's it for um, nod uh, I'm gonna go ahead and continue on with these reviews using uh, Adaware we can go ahead and load up Adaware with uh, nod and see if Adaware detects uh, additional items. So, talk to y'all later.